Greetings and salutations, folks. I'm Josh from Lazy Acres. Thank you for tuning in. We are saving the world here one trailer at a time. Today, we're going to take a look at a 2023 Flagstaff E Pro model number 20 FBS. It's got a front walk around bed, a big bathroom at the backside, small slide in the side, weighing 35.50. For the overall weight this is about as awesome as naming your pet rock stone and i'm here with my friend that dutch bad boy brendan hannemeyer on the camera today say hello brendan how's it going happy campers future campers and fellow salespeople? thank you so much for tuning in to the number one rv youtube channel in the world please click that like and subscribe button thank you for doing that we're on instagram we're on tiktok and we're on facebook have fun on all the platforms we're producing some sweet reels on these things you should check those out as well if i had a rock i would call him stone cold steve austin <laughs> <laughs> all right, front power jack, 20 power paint tanks, battery in a box. They're all coming standard with this great looking front fiberglass cap and a bit built in windshield there to bring that nice natural light in. This is the optional bike rack in the front of here. I'm a big fan of that. We got our pass through storage going all the way through there, right to the other side. We have four manual stabilizer jacks, our six gallon gas electric water heater, and then our Schwinn textile slide pulling our couch off the floor. We've also got the optional slide top on this one. And we're gonna try to option that on when we can. We got big tires here. These are 15 inch Westlake Mudder tires, torsion suspension built in, sewer drain down below, 30 amp detachable style cord. And then just in case you wanna bring more bikes or some kind of storage rack or something like that, you can slide that here into your rear hitch receiver. Roof ladder, get up on your roof, check your seals every 90 days. As we stand here at the back, you're gonna see how deep the arch is, which is great for rain runoff. It's also great for head height in a shorter trailer. We have our uh, freshwater connection, our black water flush kit, and our antifreeze outlet right there. An outside shower right there. A little bit of bonus storage here at the back, Brandon. What are you gonna put back here, brother? I'm gonna hide my ice maker there. Hide your ice maker there. And plug her in right here. Perfect, bingo bango, baby. Bippity boppity. All right, so. There is a griddle in the front storage. It's gonna clip on right here for you, hook up down below. You're gonna plug your ice maker in here, maybe a TV. We got our furnace vent here, our lend a hand grab handle, two step, aluminum step. Big on it, it goes the full span of the roof line, outside speakers, frameless windows throughout, a range hood vent, and then right here is just the other side of our pass through. You'll see there's actually an outside table here as well, which is super slick. Let's see what kind of travel access we have here with the slide out clothes. We can obviously get to the bed, we can sit on our couch, we can get to our fridge, and we can sneak into our washroom-ish. You gotta be really skinny, Brendan. So I guess you're not sneaking into your washroom unless you're skinnier than Jay Allen. Let's get this thing popped open. Right on folks, we're inside that 20 FBS Flagstaff E-Pro here. You're standing in front of the washroom, looking forward. You see what I mean by this arch here, Brennan? Yes. It makes it feel a lot taller than it is. You're six foot six, you're definitely able to stand up in here. Uh, we got great windows on either side of the bed. We got these awesome roller shades, standard on these E-Pros as well, which are super slick. We've got our switch down here for our built-in inverter. Solar panel on the roof charging your battery. Inverter taking that battery power. Inverting it up to tw uh, 12 volts if you want. Or sorry, 12 volts up to 110. We've got storage here underneath our bed. You can see proof of all the aluminum framing. Then you can see our larger drawers here below the bed. All finished off with plywood, nice stuff. And then we got bedside tables. Both sides of the bed have USB and receptacles. We got that front windshield with a blind. And then we got hanging storage on either side of the bed with a couple cubbies right there above. There's your main door. We're walking in the trailer. We've got our couch here across. Quite comfortable in here. I'm facing the TV action too, which is great. Is this gonna flip over for cup holders? You betcha. Bet you better believe it, bud. And then we got a TV, uh, sorry, t a table in behind this couch we can set up and eat our dinner or our breakfast or our lunch or our snacks or anything like that. 12 volt TV is coming standard. That's your radio now too, it's all built into one. We've got seamless counters, stainless steel sink, pop down piece with a cutlery drawer right here. Below our oven, we've got a pop down piece here for a pot and pan spot. 
oven right there, glass stove top cover, range hood, and then overhead storage right in through here. Right here's your charge controller, controlling the amount of amperage that goes to your battery off the solar panel. Microwave, and then our 12 volt fridge is in through here. Okay. Wash them here at the back. We got a porcelain toilet here, Brandon, on a 20 foot trailer. Big fan of that. The squat check definitely checks out. Dump truck fits. Cupboard there. Uh, fake cupboard there. Stainless steel sink. Double medicine cabinet here above. And then in behind or above the toilet, got another cupboard there. Now, I'm six feet tall. Let's see here if I fit. Yeah, my head has to be in the skylight here a little bit, but I definitely can shower here. This is a great shower curtain, keeping the water in. We've also got that built-in shower miser. That's the video, folks. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, hit us up on Instagram, Facebook, and TikTok. Leave us a comment down below, and then have yourself a good day.